Hello friends, welcome to Take Two for this Wednesday, the 20th of November 2019. I'm Jeannie, it's home day. I hope you're having a wonderful day so far. Well, uh, today was a really beautiful morning. We had a really good night's sleep and we got up early this morning and at 6 a.m. we decided that we would take a nice walk in the neighborhood. A little brisk, it was really beautiful. It was a little dewy outside, but primarily, you know, that was going to all burn off and it was just going to be a beautiful sunny day about 70 degrees here in southeast Alabama. Well, after we took this nice about 30, 45 minute walk through the neighborhood, we came back and we decided we would go in the backyard, Michael and I, and just see how things were doing, uh, what froze when we had that cold come through, and uh, just that kind of thing, and just have a look in the yard and see what was growing, what, was, what needed to be pulled weeds-wise, and that kind of thing. And we went over to our uh, loquat tree that we have growing. Now this is a tree that uh, Michael planted, and uh, and we also have a um, pear tree that we planted. And these are just special plants we have growing in our yard. Well, the, pe the pear tree is actually a tree for my mother, honoring my mother. So I went over and I always like to look at it and just have a moment, you know. And as I was walking over and looking at the pear tree, I noticed that there was one little drop of water, one little tiny droplet of water on one of the leaves in the yard. I'm going to turn around and see you, see if you can see it right there. It's right behind me, and here's the loquat tree right behind me. But uh, that little one droplet of water, I said, isn't that amazing, Michael? That one little droplet of water, who would just seem rather insignificant, has a purpose. It has a purpose. Perhaps it'll serve as a spot of refreshment for a hummingbird going by or maybe it's for a little bug or maybe it's a going to be something that uh, a little tiny insect of some kind can bathe himself I don't know but or maybe it's just there for uh, uh, being uh, something to help the plant grow help keep the leaf green and fresh whatever the reason one tiny little droplet of water served its purpose. Do you see where I'm going with this, boys and girls? Sometimes we think that our tiny little insignificant contribution to something doesn't serve any purpose. But the fact of the matter is, if a tiny droplet of water could serve a purpose, what things that we could do, what words of encouragement we could share, what simple little things that we could do, tasks in this world, even the tiniest thing, like maybe saying thank you to somebody, or just being polite, or doing a gesture or a smile that one tiny little thing like that droplet of water will serve a purpose likewise and I don't want to be a Debbie Downer here but likewise if you do little tiny things that are discouragements they serve a purpose too for bad let's serve tiny little purposes today all throughout our day especially this home day all for good, so that we could give somebody a lift to their life today, okay? And maybe even do something constructive. Now, I'm going to encourage you to go out and be a blessing to somebody today. You may end up being the only one who is. And let me say this, if you could be an encouragement by just being a little droplet of water to them, go out and do that, okay? Be refreshment, be, be something helpful and nourishing and blessing to somebody, okay? Now, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hey, that would be a droplet of water for me. Go to my YouTube channel, Jeannie Sigler, J-E-A-N-N-E-S-I-G-L-E-R. Hit the um, notification bell. Hit the uh, subscribe button. You'll be notified every time another take two is posted. Okay, I love you all very much. Now, listen, you take care, and I will see you tomorrow. I love you all very much. Bye-bye.